Hello everybody, welcome back to another video with Mr. Coder and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to do verify password. Problem A from Educational Code Forces round 166 rated for division 2. So Monocarp is working on its new site and the current challenge is to make the users pick strong passwords. And the requirements for a strong password is that they sh it should only contain lowercase Latin letters and digits. There should be no digit that comes after a letter. And uh, so after each letter, there either is either another letter or the string it ends. Or, and then the next thing is all digits should be sorted in the non-decreasing non order and all letters should be sorted in non-decreasing order. And it's also allowed for passwords to have only letters or only digits. And Monocarp already did the lowercase Latin letters and digits, but he he struggles with the other requirements. So you need to help him verify the passwords. So for example, this 12AC, it checks them because there's no digit that comes after a letter because it's one, two, and then it's AC. And then the digits are sorted. One, two is sorted in non-decreasing order. And then AC is sorted. So it's yes. Whereas this one, one, two, three is sorted, but WA is not sorted. It's decreasing, not, it's, yes, yeah, decreasing. Whereas this, and then for this one, this is A with four L's, and then it's most, and then it's, it's sorted in non-decreasing order, and there's no digits, which still works. This one doesn't work because the letters come before the numbers. And this one works because it's just digits and they're sorted in non-decreasing order. So what I did, so I made these functions just to check if it's a letter or a number. And then I made two arrays just to sort, just so then I can separate the numbers and letters. And what I do is I check if the current, if the current one and the next one if what if the first one's a letter and the next one's a number, then it's guaranteed no. So I can just quit. I can just print no and leave right there. And then if it's a letter, I add it to the letters. If it's a number, I add it to the numbers. And then I sort another. I sort another two arrays. One for the numbers. One for the letters. I sort them, which are defaults to non decreasing. And then, it if it's equal to the sorted array, if the numbers is equal to the sorted array for numbers, if the letters is equal to the sorted array for letters, then it works. Otherwise it doesn't. Then if we check with the sample, it prints it prints all of the correct answers. So yeah, this is how you do verify password from educational code forces around 166 rated for division two, problem A. So yeah, thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.